Dr. Gregory Orton here, three-time Olympic medalist and world champion in track and field. Thank you all for coming over to this channel. If you like the content, please give me a thumbs up. If you think the content is worthy to be shared, please be generous and share. And also, if this is your first time coming over to this channel, please subscribe and hit the notification button so you do not miss a video when the videos are uploaded. Today we're going to give you an injury update of Sharika Jackson because recently at the Hungarian meet she had a major scare. We saw where she screamed out and stopped and walked over the finish line. Now after the race a lot of people were concerned as to her fitness and whether or not the injury was severe. So I am here to give you an injury report as to how Sharika is doing and I also want to ask you a question based on what you saw do you think that Sharika can be fully ready to win that 100 meters knowing that she has to go up against someone like a Shelley and Fraser Price and a Shakiri Richardson please feel free to share your opinion in the comment section now after looking at the race I was a little bit worried when I saw Sharika stopped but I was more concerned when I saw the look on her face because it was telling me that something was drastically wrong. Now, the report coming out of her camp is that she is doing well. She had a cramp. That's what it was reported to be. It is said that she is walking around. It is said that she did a little test on the leg to make sure that she is good for now and they will continue to work on the injury leg just to make sure that she will be ready within the next few weeks now the question i am asking you again do you think that with the limited time that we have that sharika can be fully ready to be competitive knowing that her competitors are ready to compete please feel free to share your opinion again in the comment section i must also say that i've seen it on numerous occasions where athletes compete so close before a major championship and something went wrong that prevented them from actually be competitive in their event and in this case it was indeed a scare and i hope that the information coming out of sharika jackson camp that it's accurate where we as the spectators have the right expectations we want her to be very competitive even if she don't win but we are going after the win a jamaican win altogether so i want to hear your comment do you think jamaica can get at least two medals in the women 100 meters please feel free to share your opinion again in the comment section i thank you all for listening i am dr gregory Horton. have a blessed day